Hello you beautiful 99ers, hope you're having a wonderful day so far. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I am Sway to the 99 um, and I like pineapples. <laughs> so I am wearing my apron the, that RJ Olives had gifted me. So RJ Olives, you can see the apron is back, so don't come for me. <laughs> um, so if you are new to my channel, welcome. As I mentioned, I am Sway to the 99 and I typically post videos every Monday, Wednesday and Saturday. So I do a little bit of everything. I do um, budget meals, which I will be doing today, where I show you guys how to make a very delicious meal using ingredients that I found either at the 99 cent only store or at the Dollar Tree or both. So, <coughs> excuse me. So, um, typically I post Dollar Tree walkthroughs and hauls and 99 cent only store walkthroughs and hauls and of course, budget meals. So that is what we're going to be doing today. So with that, let's get started. So I wanna show you guys the meal that I'll be making today. This is one of my go-to, very quick, easy, I like to call it my protein bowl. Um, this is actually my dinner for Sunday. Um, I know I typically post these on Wednesdays, but because I'm a little behind, I decided to um, post up a video on Sunday, but I will be posting again on Wednesday. So anyway, starting off with the spinach, that was gonna be my base. I'm gonna be throwing in some cherry tomatoes, and I'm gonna be using a um, lemon as my part of my dressing, which I absolutely love, and I'll show you guys how, to, how I make it. Um, some avocado, some black beans, and of course some other ingredients. And I've never tried this one before, this specific one. So I'm gonna try this one tonight. These are Tarians, uh, Salsa Verde, um, um, uh, rice. <laughs> I'm like, what is it? <laughs> um, and I'm also gonna be doing some uh, lemon water as well at the end. So as you guys can see, this is a really simple but very delicious meal that I like to do from time to time, especially when I'm feeling like I really need to get back on a healthy kick, and which is what I'm trying to do this month of January. So, all right, let's time to prep. All right, so the first thing I need to do is to prep the rice. So in order to do that, I do need to pour uh, one and a half cups of water into a pan. There we go. and throw in just a pinch of oil. It recommends for it to be butter, but I don't really like butter in my, in my rice, so I'm gonna be using oil, and I think it's totally fine to substitute. So I'm gonna let this um, boil up for a few minutes and then throw in the rice. So really excited to try this one. Oops, sorry about that. Um, to try this one, you guys can see, um, here are the benefits, it's gluten-free, and no added MSG. So I'm really excited to try this version. And again, this is what I like to call my protein bowl. I normally just throw it in regular rice, but I saw this and I said, you know what? I wanna give it a try. So, all right, let me continue on and prepping the goodies. All right, so the perfect time, the water is boiling. I'm gonna throw in the rice and all of the contents. There we go. Give it a quick stir, make sure everything gets into the water. Lower the heat to low. There we go. And I'm gonna let this sit for about 10 minutes and cover it. All right, so while we wait for the rice to continue to cook, I'm gonna wash my veggies. Um, and if you guys do have any ideas of things that you'd like me to try, please let me know in the comment section. I am kind of running out of ideas, <laughs> or at least things that I definitely want to show you guys. Um, you know, I basically have done a full year worth of budget meals. Um, so if you guys haven't checked out, I do have a lot of great ideas um, that I've done in the past. Um, so if you do have any ideas that you'd like me to try, please do comment down below. There we go. And now for our spinach. Gonna soak up some spinach in water for a few minutes and then I'm going to um, just dry it up. There we go. Again, just gonna let it soak for a moment. Doesn't it sound very ASMR? <laughs> there we go. And 
next, I'm going to dry it. And this is a sharper image. Um, I actually got this as a gift two years ago. Um, and I absolutely love it. I think my friend got it at Ross. There we go. And I absolutely love it. It really does a great job at rinsing out your, um, your veggies. You can see I'm literally just spinning it. There we go, the excess water. Ta-da! All right, so while we are still in the sink area, let me just drain out the beans. And the good thing about the canned beans is that they are already pre-cooked, so you can pretty much eat them like this. And that is what I'm planning on doing, because usually with the um, Power Bowls, I usually just don't, you know, I like to keep it as fresh as possible or at least as fresh as one can get from using a can. <laughs> um, there we go. So now that we have our, oop, now that we have our um, rice pretty much done, what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to start with the dressing that I'm gonna to top off the power bowl with and also what I'll be using for my water. This is definitely one of my favorites and one of the most easiest um, salad dressings, I don't even call it a salad dressing, but the most topping, easiest toppings I've ever made. There we go. And I did purchase this at the 99 cent only store and I absolutely love it. It is one of my favorite tools I have here in my kitchen. I'm just gonna pour it all in here. Perfect. Now, this is the fun part. So you, you basically just want to put a little bit, not too, not too much. You just want to put enough where you feel comfortable, what works for you. So just kind of eyeball it. And just a pinch of garlic. There we go. And a black pepper. You can also add salt. I just prefer not to because I feel like with the um, lemon, it's already um, pretty tart. So you don't really need to add more to it. And now you just literally mix it in. It's pretty easy. And it's so delicious. Trust me on that. All right, so now to kind of start putting everything together. And as I, as I mentioned before, this is a really simple recipe. So I think we're gonna start off with the um, spinach. There we go, so that's gonna serve as our base. Looks nice and pearly. And then, going to throw in our rice. There we go. Yeah, just a little more. Perfect. Oh, okay, maybe just another splash. Perfect. And what is nice about these um, this rice is that it already comes with its beans, um, but I do like my beans, so I'm gonna throw it in just a little few more from the can, um, just to sprinkle them on to give it a little bit more of, um, just a little bit of variety of color. There we go. Perfect. And now to throw in our cherry tomatoes. You can kind of just sprinkle them as you see fit. There we go. There. Next, we want to throw in throw in our avocado and like I said um, it wasn't 100% perfect um, it was a little overripe so I am just going to um, use um, what I can and discard of what is not edible so it is not 100% photogenic but oops, <laughs> but it still looks good to me there we go and sometimes dinner does not need to be perfect it does not need to be you know, Instagram worthy. There we go. And now for my favorite part, the dressing. 
gonna get that all around, get some out to the, there we go. But mainly I wanna make sure that it soaks it around the edges where all the spinach is hanging out. And just a little bit on top, perfect. Oh, you guys, this smells so good. Can't wait to try it. I'm gonna lift you guys up. And you can see right there, this is what it looks like. It looks so delicious. Um, oh my God, it really looks so yummy. Yummy, yummy. All right, now to make my water. Ooh, let's get the water ready. Nice and zesty. All right, it's time to fill it up. And yes, you guys, I do drink tap water. It is, there's nothing wrong with it. It's very delicious and it's free. Well, you know, free. <laughs> I do pay for water. Um, so I'm gonna let that kind of, you know, get a little nice and cold and do our taste test. All right, so it's time to give this beautiful Power Bowl a taste and a spoiler alert. I know I'm gonna like it because I've made this pre, I made this before. This is one of my go-to here at home. Mmm. Wow. Okay, I definitely love this rice. If you guys see it at your local 99, give it a try. Mmm. It's really flavorful. Now for the cherry tomatoes. Mmm. This is really filling. All right. It's really filling, it's budget friendly, and it definitely um, will keep you full, which is great. So that is the perfect trifecta. Mmm, it is so good. This is definitely more of a, I like, I wanted to eat this because it is definitely a kind of reset for beginning of the year. Trying to eat healthier after all the craziness in December. <laughs> Sorry. And of course our lemon water. Oh wow, that is so delicious. Woo, I can't wait to devour it. Um, so like I said to you guys, um, if you do have any budget um, meal ideas you'd like me to try, please let me know in the comment section because if you guys have been watching me for a while, you know that I always make what you guys recommend to me. Mmm, that is so good. And I do have some recipes that I'm gonna be making in the upcoming weeks that were actually sent to me during the holidays in one of the Christmas cards. So don't don't worry, I did not forget about you. I will be making those as well. So, hmm. Well, I tried to actually shoot this a little differently today, guys, so I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and I will be back tomorrow on Monday, if you're watching this on Sunday, I will be back tomorrow on Monday for my Dollar Tree walkthrough. Um, and again, I will be back on Wednesday now for my usual um, budget meal. So I will, I'm going back to my regular schedule um, with a few surprises sprinkled in, of course. Um, so yeah, so definitely be, be sure to come back tomorrow, Monday, and also on Wednesday and of course Saturday for my 99 cent only store walkthrough. So um, quick note, if you guys haven't checked out the 99 Shopaholics, definitely give them a follow. Um, they're an amazing Facebook group and I'm actually one of the moderators. So. If you want to pop in, say hi, definitely join the group. Um, and like I did mention before, I do have a year's worth of budget meals. So if you guys have not been watching me from the beginning, um, definitely check them out. Uh, check, check out the series. I will um, put it here on the screen somewhere. Um, you guys can check out all of the videos that I've made that are budget friendly and that I've used um, all ingredients that I found at the 99 cent only store. Um, so again, if you do have any budget meal ideas, let me know because I would love to try them. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and a great, wonderful week. So I will see you in the next one. So as always, don't forget to do the 99.